Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 44, and this is war number eight. And we're going up against an alliance called Peaky Blinders. All right, so let's see who they've banned. All right, Hulk, Void, they seem to be very popular bands, and they banned my boy Hercules, but that's okay. Because by banning Hercules, I can now use him in AQ, the six star uh, um, ascended version and not the five star one, which has been doing just fine and rock in AQ. And it also opens up um, possibilities for other champs like Silk uh, to join. All right. Uh, let's uh, see what they got planned for us. And we really need to do better. We have not done very well these last. Um, yeah, these last few wars. We have not done well. And I am upset with myself on the last war because I said I was going to do something and then I didn't do it. And it cost me. So you see, we've got Nimrod and we've got Viv Vision. I'm bringing Gallon. I don't care. I'm bringing Gallon. That's what's going to happen. Okay. Gallon is coming. He's going to take that. Now, next up. We've got uh, Infamous Iron Man, and we've got Omega Sentinel. I can bring Corvus for that. All right, that should not be um, problematic. I have fought him before, and yeah, this should be just fine. They're not global defenders. So, Gallon, Corvus, and now let's take a look here and see who we have. So, um, normally, you would have, um, Claire would be great for Hulkling, but because of this high-energy diet, you do not want that. So, I can bring, say, for example, Hulkling against that Hulkling. That can work. Uh, I'm not messing with that uh, Dragon Man, although I could. I don't like Root. Uh, let's see. We've got uh, Gallon here. One eye open, blah, blah, blah. Got to knock him down. Um, I'm pretty sure uh, Silk could do that one. And let's see what we got here. So we've got... He is so annoying, but... Uh, let's see. Uh, if I took this one, incinerate shock. I could probably use, um, infamous Iron Man, but let's see what, what else we got going on. Incinerate poison. This one here, very annoying fight. Very annoying. Uh, let's see. So we got Ebony Maw. As soon as I see Ebony Maw, let's see. You got the placebo. Resistance is futile. Defender gets a non-stacking power game. Hmm. So I was going to say this would be great for, and, and he's a global defender. I don't know if it would be good to bring in someone who is immune to buffs because that means that the placebo buff, if they're immune to it, rather than shrugging it off or anything else like that, could be very dangerous. He could go right to um, high power. So that might take some discussion. Here's another global defender here. Got to be careful with him. Um, I think anybody that can bring maybe a Human Torch can do that fight. And then we have Thing. Hmm. Let's see. The attacker triggers a buff, immediately nullified. So, Silk might do well on this one. So could... um. 
Hmm. I have to think about that because I might I might want to take that thing out. Silk could do it. Valkyrie might be able to do it. Yeah. Maybe Valkyrie. Yeah, Power Sting. Yeah, I think Valkyrie might might do well there. So we'll see. But Galen is coming. Corvus is coming. And then one other for one of these guys here. And I'm eyeing that thing. And I'm thinking Valkyrie would be a good one for that. Now, that power snack is annoying. So... I don't know. Valkyrie. Valkyrie might be a great option, but I might might have somebody else. Um, maybe Spider-Man 2099 or Titania, you know, or um, who else? Well, somebody that, that doesn't gain buffs. Um, and I always think of Spider-Man 2099 or Titania. And yeah. And you would just have to play him, you know, the way that you have to fight him, you know, without any uh, gimmicks like, you know, Valkyrie having a pierce so she can hit him, you know, no problem. Um, but I do like Valkyrie for that fight. So we'll see. All right. Let's get on with the fighting. OK, so I'm going in with Gallon, Silk and Corvus. So. You guys know about Silk, right? Yeah. And you should also know about Gallon. Now, you heard me complaining many a time that I should have gone in with Gallon when I see clear Gallon food. This war, I said, I don't care what anybody suggests. Gallon is going to come and take that path. That's Gallon food that I'm looking at right there. Can Corvus do it? Well, we already know Corvus can't do that uh, Nimrod fight. Can he do the other fight? Nah, nah, maybe. But we're not going to find out today. That last war had me kind of tilted. I was upset. Okay. And I said, you know what? This war, full focus. Super, super serious mode. Okay. All right, so you see, I'm just looking, I'm just, I'm like, I don't even care. All right, so we already know what Gallon does to people like this. Look at this. I'm already up there, three, four, five. I just got to get to my special. All right, bam. Huh. And skadooshie. That's how it should go. Now, if they had banned Gallon, we got somebody else for him, you know. Always oh, got somebody. Now, this fight here. I want y'all to pay very close attention. Something happens in this fight. Now, you just saw how easy Gallon did that, right? Watch very closely in this fight. Okay? Same thing. 16 armor ups. We don't care. Okay? Look at this. Look at this. We just need to... Get this. All right, here we go. Now watch this, guys. Did y'all see that? Did you see that? Go back and look. You guys know what I'm trying to do there. So why did Gallon just stop and stand up like this? That is what happens sometimes when I go for a heavy attack. Do you remember in one of our previous wars, I was talking about how I sometimes get a delay? You saw right there, there was no heavy attack, and he just stood there. Fortunately, she did not attack us, and I was able to back off. But that is what happens. That one fight, I did the heavy, and it hesitated, then it did it, and then I got resisted, parried, five-hit combo, and a special. Those kinds of things, 
are what really ticked me off because they're out of my control. There's nothing I could do. I said, here, do a heavy attack. And the game said, no. What am I going to do? I can't argue with the game. I can't fight that. No amount of skill can handle that. Fortunately, we were able to get through that. But I wanted to point that out to you guys because we struggle with these input issues. And in a game mode like this, it just makes it that much worse. Same thing with Battlegrounds, where any mistake is extremely costly. You know? So knowing that the game is in this state, what do you think Kabam should do? Maybe ease up a little bit? Make it a little less costly? Whatever. All right, so here we go. And we are fighting uh, Infamous Iron Man with Corvus. Shouldn't have any problems here. Look at that. Beautiful. I even did a nice little uh, power back boost. Look at this. But the problem is he power locks you for the entire time that he's getting that uh, regen. So I'm just going in and I'm just like, whatever. Cause I know the regen's coming off. Ha ha ha. And I was waiting for him. There we go. I used that relic just to buy me some time and said, yeah, it ain't going to last forever. Next up, we've got Omega Sentinel. Now with Omega Sentinel, you want to fight her by alternating your attacks. Well, guess what? To maximize your damage with Corvus, you want to alternate his attacks. It's a match made in heaven. So we do a parry. Ha, ha, ha. Medium light, medium. Bam. Heavy. Look at this. Just tearing her up. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Don't want to beat into her block because then she'll get a whole bunch of armor ups. But there we go. Poof. And done. Nice, smooth, and easy. Corvus is back, back again. Now, I believe this is the final fight of the war. And this fight is one that I was both looking forward to and was a little nervous about. Now, I know how to fight Thing. I fought Thing with many different characters. I don't remember fighting thing with uh, Silk. I remember trying, but I didn't know her um, abilities well enough, like the um, like her her slow. I didn't know quite how that worked, and I'm like, okay, I thought the slow was gonna go, but it didn't. I got it now. Okay, so you just have to really manage your rock stack. See, she got he got the protection up. That's fine. I'm just going in and I'm aggressive. So keep looking up there. Notice that when he goes against the wall, he gets a slow. All right. And when I do a heavy attack, there we go. Look at this. So I'm managing the rock stacks and I'm waiting, playing it. You know, I didn't try. I could have done a heavy right there. I could have just went ba -da dot and then gone into a heavy. But I said, no. Let's just go old school and play it safe. Okay. So here we go. And he's aggressive. Woo! I like it when they're aggressive like that. All right. See, here we go. Look at that. See? Got the he has the slow on him. So we didn't have to worry about it. Lovely. And it got paused. Yeah. And I'm losing health. And I need to um check that node again because I can't remember why I was losing that health. Uh, was it the power sting? I can't remember. Um, it probably was the power sting because I was ignoring all of that and too busy watching his uh, rock stacks and, and all of this. Too bad he had the protection up right there or else that would have taken him out. Uh, taken him out. But we got him down anyway. Not the prettiest fight against Thing with Silk. And I can get better, but at least I won. Okay. No deaths, smooth run. All right. So we'll be back in a little bit. And I think everybody was zeroed in and focused in. So we'll be back in a moment and you will find out 
how this war ended. And we're back, and the losing streak is over. Over. All right. You can see here, we we fought. We fought very well. Let me see something. Let's see the overall. There we go. Whoops. Hey, there I am. Down there at 19. That's okay. Keeping it tight and not dying. All right. Whoop. Why does it do that? All right. Let me uh, look at the uh, my BG. Oh. Tells a little bit different story. Rank four. All right. Um, but let me see. So we did da, 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 da. diversity defender kills 14. Okay. Um, but a lot of those didn't count. I'm trying to um, remember the calculation. So the attack bonus, I don't think, did anybody get 142, 144. Okay, so we got the most attack bonus. Um, I think the attack bonus is 150. So a lot of those defender kills didn't count. Somebody help me out with that, how you figure that, right? Um, but in any case, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.